Hi everybody, happy Friday! Hope you're ready for weekend. I sure as hell am. But before I leave you to your weekend, I'm gonna paint a tiny little painting that I had in my mind for a while now. So uh, this one is, uh, I'm, I'm working from a reference photo here that I got from Paint My Photo where I am part of the community and you will find the links to the photographer and her name and everything in the description box below as well as on the blog post that's gonna go live 10 minutes after this video is up. So check her out, she has some very lovely photos there. Um, I did take one of her photos and uh, transferred the parts that I wanted to my watercolor paper and then I'm gonna color. So I, ha I saw something a couple of weeks ago and it on, on Instagram and it didn't it didn't leave my mind um, so I really well try to work with it and change it to my needs and my wants uh, in my head for a couple of weeks and well now I'm painting I'm painting this red stag with watercolors only it's, it's only three or four colors if I remember correctly well you can see it on the on the blog, there's a material list and close-up photos and stories and blah, 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 blah. All of that's gonna be there for all the things that I published this week. But um, what I what I liked was uh, giving an animal kind of like a landscape tattoo. I liked that uh, idea and I, I don't know where I saw it, but I think I saw something like that on Instagram and like I said, it just, it just stayed with me. So, um, yeah, I, I, I tattooed <laughs> the red stag's uh, fur with um, what is in my head an autumn landscape. It's autumn, I like autumn and, uh, well, um, wild animals, game animals, they're, well, they're, they're definitely in the category of autumn, at least in my head, so I like to paint them kind of more often. <laughs> Not only pumpkins, folks. Mm -mm. It's also, it's also stags and rabbits or, uh, I don't know, boars or stuff. So I, I, I took the rabbit uh, no, not the rabbit. The, oh gosh, folks! <laughs> it's time that I have weekend. I took the red stag this time to, well, paint him and give him what I like to think is an autumn. It seemed like those leaves leaving the tree there, flowing away in the wind. I'm just uh, liking the idea of a rather simple kind of a painting. I'm just going with layers and layers and layers of watercolor in not very many shades or tones, color tones, but just taking pretty much the same color or the same color family and then intensifying or having light and shadow done with just the amount of layers that is um, on, on the page. I really like it. That idea. It, it gives something like a serene and very calm feeling, which I also um, associate with autumn. So, yeah, there's there's why I did that, I guess. I don't know. There's more to the story. It, like I said, it will be on the blog. But uh, I really liked working on a rather simple, almost kind of an illustration y painting uh, this week. And, well, having a lot of white space. So you will see that uh, giving a tiny bit of a background uh, only to the stack here is all that I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna ground him on the paper and that's that. No other items there. I want the stack to be the focal point and it be a very, yeah, very calm scene. I'm adding a tiny bit of a black marker just to intensify some of the lines and uh, yeah then that's pretty much it a tiny bit of gel pen and I'm done so I hope you enjoyed watching along if you have any questions or comments please leave them in the comment section below 
I will see you next week with new artwork. Tomorrow I will see you with a new vlog episode. You can see what happened this week uh, in, in my studio or in my life in general. And um, I will see you back next week with new artwork. Have fun, everybody. Do all the good YouTube stuff. Like, share, subscribe. And hop on over to the vlog. Uh, to the, blog. the link is in the web page. The link is in the description box below and you can read up all of the stories behind all of the paintings that I did this week. Have fun folks. Happy weekend. Oh, and by the way, mm, I hope you have some time to create. Go, go create something. Have fun folks. Bye.